Depleted uranium is blowing in the air. Depleted uranium, does anybody really care? Since 1991, 400,000 times, the Hiroshima-Nagasaki bombs. I, really want to, I want to share you how I feel. You know, it's, uh, I think ha things happen for a reason, right? I never thought I'd be the Pohakalo commander. Bottom of my heart, man, I'm here for the people. And the thing is, I, I really have a respect for the land. You know, and I'm not here to sway you guys like, hey, this is... This is the military, you know, I'm not trying to sway you on my side. All I'm trying to do is make sure we just have education. I'm trying to get, I'm learn, learn more about the land. And then I'm trying to teach more about Pohaka law and make it transparent to you guys. Then one of my goals when you say outreach, I broke it down to three subcategories, right? People, events, and then projects. So when you look at the people, right, just like talking to you guys, making sure I'm transparent to you guys. But then the other part of it is to make sure I have the equipment, to make sure I take care of the land that I keep, we keep ourselves, the army, responsible for. My full name is Loretto Borsi Jr. People know me as Loretto. People know me as Jr. And I share that with you guys. I, you know, that's that's my. I'm very transparent. That is my agenda, and that's what I share with you guys. And they're depleted uranium coming to your neighborhood. Depleted uranium. The news doesn't seem that good. It's radioactive dust that is killing us round live fire ranges and combat zones. It's radioactive dust that is killing us round live fire ranges and combat zones. Depleted uranium is being covered up with lies. Depleted uranium, it's time we realize. Soldiers bring it home as Gulf War Syndrome, it's a radioactive plague. Depleted uranium, we know what all of this means. Depleted uranium, it damages our genes. Babies being born, they are deformed in Iraq and the USA. Taking the readings of of how many you know, counts on the radiation readings here, so I'm guessing it's uh, averaging about 36, but it's spiking here. I have a spike at 918 that went up to 68, so that's pretty high for the wind that's coming off the north. Uh, if the wind was coming off the base, it'd probably be higher. You know, these are young school children who are coming on to... They're using the school children as PR to show it's safe when it isn't, right? That's, that's, really, that's really evil, you know?